Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to replace the aperture flux cable on a Sigma 18-50mm f2.8 lens after the lens has been disassembled. Recently I had this lens with a faulty aperture. The problem was caused by a faulty flux cable, so I had to disassemble the lens, replace the flux cable with a new one and then assemble the lens. In this video I show you how to replace the flux cable with a new one. This video is part of video series about repairing the Sigma 18-50mm f2.8 lens. In the first previous video I showed you how to disassemble the lens. This second one is about replacing the flux cable with a new one. And the next one is about assembling the lens. If you are interested in the other two videos, then the links are in the description below. Before I will start let me talk about the tools that I will use to replace the flux cable with a new one. I will use a PH30 screwdriver a metal tweezers, a cutting pliers, a soldering gun, soldering iron, the soldering pump, and of course I will need a new flex cable. If you are interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. I hope this video will be useful, helpful, informative and adds value to you. If that's the case, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, send me a donation, or buy a camera or lens from my webshop. Links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. Also, in the description there is an update section. If I have anything to add to this video after the video has been posted, then I add it there. So I would highly recommend to check it. So, let's get started. This is the old broken aperture flux cable, which will be replaced with a new one. Cut off the motor and the end of the cable. Use the soldering pump and soldering gun to remove the soldering iron. Lift up the end of the flex cable. Remove the soldering iron from the other end of the cable. Remove the flex cable. Remove the soldering iron and the flex cable from the motor.
solder the flex cable on the motor. Put back the motor to its place. Put back the screws. Put back the screw in the cable holder. Solder the two connectors of the flex cable. We finished replacing the cable with a new one. Join me in the next video where I show you how to assemble the lens. Link in the description below. I hope this video was helpful, useful, informative and added value to you. If that's the case, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, send me a donation or buy a camera or lens from my webshop. Links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. So thank you very much for watching and looking forward to meet you in one of my other videos.